stepped in at that time. Can I? Get the machine gun set up over there. Everybody else, inside the bunker. Move. Think about that. Yeah. Okay, sorry. Uh, they think we can get up that hill like crazy. Crops on every inch of it. Okay, Kirby, I got it. That's tough, all right. Tough isn't the word. On top of that starts had to buy it. I wonder what Lieutenant Hanley's going to do now. Jason. And Vic Morrow. I don't pay any attention to him, Lieutenant. He's got a hole there you could lose a grenade in. How are we doing out there, Lieutenant? They give up yet? I make it. Two machine guns, barbed wire each pillbox. How about you? See anything else? I don't need anything else. Oh, Doc, forget it. My leg doesn't hurt that much. <laughs> yeah, I'll bet it doesn't. I don't want it. Until we get what we came for, I'm not going to be any good asleep. Maybe quite a while before we get what we came for. Well, then you ought to take the shot. Now, Doc, I don't want it. If the pain gets any worse, give him the shot. Don't pay any attention to him. Yes, sir. Oh, we bought some trouble, huh? A little. Sure glad I'm not wearing those bars. Boy, I've seen enough hills as an oak. Crocs up on top like that. Nothing but open ground all the way up here. 
that nothing short of a miracle gets on top of that hill. Hey, man. We might be able to make it if we have a little help. Like an Italian? Yeah. Cross off that hill zeroed in if you make as much as one move. And you've had it. All right, knock off that kind of talk. The whole division is moving up this morning, and we're part of it. We're going out and take that hill. Lieutenant, I've been thinking. The ground sort of rises there on the right. Maybe if a man, maybe one man, could climb within range and throw a few grenades. If he's fast enough, he could succeed. Are you volunteering? Well, uh, I run fast enough and I keep pretty low. All right, Cage, you got to crack at it. But the minute they see you, I want you to give me elbows and heels all the way down. That's what I had in mind. Impossible, Lieutenant. A worm couldn't get up that hill. All right, Cage. I can't do any good from here, Lieutenant. Yeah. We'll have to get your machine gun closer. Yes, sir. The machine gun is useless where it is. We've got to get it at least halfway up the hill where it has a field of fire. I pick three men. Stand by with the gun on the left flank. About 200 yards up the draw, there's a dip in the ground. That's where you dig in. I'll get you cover. Okay, Lieutenant. Okay. Chester. Morgan. Einstein, you guys stand by. Better shed their packs, too. Kirby, I'll give you three to one. We both don't get off the hill this time. You're under arithmetic. What do you know? Tables don't lie. I've got this whole lot figured out. Would you like to see my tables? What kind of tables are you talking about? It's all in here. It's the percentages of who dies, who lives, how long. Does it tell you why? I don't deal in philosophy, Kirby. Just numbers. Three to one, huh? That's right. Three to one. Worse odds than that. Could use about 50 bucks of it. Bet? Bet. That's right. Two bunkers flanking the road. We're going to need help to take them. They own the whole hillside. What about an artillery mission? Coordinates 347-339. Artillery's tied up right now, Hanley. Well, then the 81s, if I might have some smoke. I can't let you have the 81s either. They're being used by Howe Company. I can let you have company mortars. No, that's not good enough. I need big stuff. Well, that's all I got, Hanley. You want them? All right. They're better than nothing. Both flanks are moving well. You're the only unit that's held up, Hanley. Three, six, three, Those bunkers of yours have also stopped item company on your left. What's more important, we need that road. Now, the old man's going to start making noises. So you get those bunkers. All right, we'll get them. Just give me the mortars. We'll try again when they come in. Out. Well, I can't get over. They dug in up here. Now they push us down that hill like they owed it. Come on, Trent. I've got to hand it to them relatives of yours. I did not tell you. Us Germans make the best soldiers in the world. <laughs> I'd come out with this with a chest full of medals. 
Yavo. Only well, one thing. I'm too scared to move. What's wrong with you? You can't think that way. You beat before you start. Now, I got it all doped out when we were up there before. If you figure, they won't hit you. They won't. You gotta keep the right frame of mind. And, uh, Kleinschmidt, they ain't gonna hit me. Stay loose, kid. We got mortars coming in. How big, Lieutenant? 60 millimeter. Well, we might as well throw rocks at them as use those things. We need some artillery in there. We take what we can get. I asked for artillery. Maybe we get it later. Oh, that's just fine. You use the draw to shield yourself part of the way up. The mortars will hold them down while you set the gun in place. Concentrate your fire to the bunker on the right. If you can hold them down, we'll take it from the flank. That's a big if, Lieutenant. You make it smaller, Kirby. When the mortars come in, I'll send you out. Yes, sir. What about that, Einstein? I'd still three to one. Nothing but company mortars? Four to one. You ready? Never ready. But I'll go when you do. Hey, Kirby. Huh? This lieutenant, he know what he's doing. What are you talking about? Sure he knows what he's doing. Sure he does. Well, I see a lot of second Louis in my kind of work. I'd just like to know. Well, don't worry about it. He's been around a long time. He knows exactly what he's doing. Well, I hope so. Very fond of my neck. Lieutenant, that's a big order. If we only had some smoke... We can't get smoke. The 81s are tied up. They're looking right down our throats. That's right, little John. Right down our throats. Yeah, but... But what? Come on. Got any ideas? No, sir. All right. Anybody else? Like I said, if we only had some smoke... Yeah. I just don't know what they expect us to do. They expect us to wrap up that hill and deliver the battalion headquarters, that's what. Well, good luck. Doc. What's happening out there? Hey, why don't we take that shot now, huh? Can't you answer a simple question? I asked you, what's happening out there? Kirby's gonna try to get a machine gun up the hill. What kind of cover? Artillery? Company mortar. That's all there is. Yeah, now, wait a minute. Just take it easy. You can't do anything about it now anyway. Hiya, Serge. How you doing? You tell me. Okay, I guess. The lieutenant knows what he's doing. What's bothering you, little John? The mortars? Yeah. They won't even dent the bunkers. Well, they can keep the crowds down, give you a chance to get the machine gun into position. Maybe. I wish you were with us. Well, I'm not. This isn't your first action, little John. I just don't want it to be my last. All right, you better get out there. You got work to do. Right, sir. Do you really think those mortars will do the job? They'll have to. Mortars.
side where you can see. Come up with me. We'll cover you while you bring the gun out. Let's go.
can in the city shire. Oh, that's a lot of Okay, roll, roll, roll off. Oh, boy. Back to the bunker. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. I guess we showed them. I never saw anything like it. It was murder. Sent men out with nothing but company mortars. That's all we have. Uh, you can tell that to Chester, the gunner. Only you can't, because they're dead. How many more? I don't know, Sarge. It's like a meat grinder up there. It just ain't right to send men up when they don't have a chance. It didn't do any good, and there ought to be a better way to do it. Kirby, you were supposed to get that gun into action. Lieutenant, a gun out in the open can't shoot it out with a gun in a bunker. I had two men dead up there and one shot up. Just what is it you want out of me, Lieutenant? Easy, Kirby. Sarge, it wasn't easy up on that hill. We can't move without a base of fire. Then, Lieutenant, you tell me how we're going to move, because I just don't know how to give you a base of fire. All right, Kirby, get back with the men. Elias, set that gun up. Sorry, may I speak with you? Yeah. Lieutenant, we've been together a long time, and uh, we do what we're told. So? So, you know, you know we don't mind tough jobs if we have a chance. But we're going up that hill with our bare hands. That's right, Lieutenant. I don't think we can ever take it. We're going to. One way or the other. We're going to take it. Get me company. Lieutenant, what I mean is... Nobody likes to get killed. And it's worse if, if it doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense? Is that why we're here? No, sir, I mean, I mean, if we only had some help. Well, help is one thing we don't have. Captain? Lieutenant Handley. Captain's on, Lieutenant. Now, you mean to stand by and wait for orders? Yes, sir. This is Handley. Captain, the mortars were ineffective. We went up the hill and they pushed us off again. My casualties are high. You have to take them, Handley. We're going to need some help. Our reserves are committed. No artillery is available. Well, what about a tank? No chance. Wait a minute. There could be one. I'll see what I can do. I can't promise anything. Neither can I unless we get some help. You have a bazooka. I can't get close enough to use it. Lieutenant, those bunkers have to be taken with or without help. Now, it's up to you. We need that road. What about the first or third platoon? They got their own problems, Hanley. There are other roads to clear. Their hands are full, but they're moving up. You're not. The old man called in, wants to know what's holding you up. I'd like to show him. The 1st and 2nd Battalions have taken their primary objectives and are moving against the secondaries. You know what that leaves us, don't you? A big hole between us and them on both flanks. I know, Captain, but... No buts, Lieutenant. Battalion commander wants action and he wants it now. Now, you move out and get those bunkers. I don't care what it takes. Yes, sir. We'll try again. Out. You heard it right. We try again, we're gonna take it. Even if it kills us. We're going to take it.
Lieutenant? Yep. Here we go again. Any help? Nope. Nothing's changed. They're still up there. We gotta go and get them. We'll do it. One way or the other. Doc. How many men have we lost? Seven. Seven. Artillery, some new tanks, that's what we need. He'll get us what he can. A grave. That's what he'll get us. So you've had it hard. Hard enough, Lieutenant. Lieutenant, why doesn't the captain get off our backs? If he knew what we were going up against... It wouldn't make any difference. He's got his orders the same as we have. I'd just like to see him carry out the orders on this thing. He doesn't have to. That's what we're here for. Well, I think that he... You can quit thinking. Just follow orders. Now, here it is. I asked for a tank. Maybe we get it, maybe we don't. Whichever, we can't wait for it. We can't do it alone either. We're going to. All alone. With what we've got. And it's not open for discussion. Yes, sir. Cage, I want you to pick six of the best rifle shots we've got in the platoon. You're going to take them as far as you can up the center. I want rapid, well-aimed fire laid down on those bunkers. Well-aimed, you understand? Yes, sir. Little John? Kirby? Not Kirby. They're gonna cover for you, Kirby. You're gonna take the machine gun up the left again, through the draw. They're gonna hold the Germans down when you get the gun into place. Well, tell you, if mortars couldn't do that job, those peace shooters... I said it wasn't open for discussion. Now, when you get the gun in action and get the bunker pinned down, I'm going to move the platoon up under your cover, get within bazooka range. That's it. That's enough. Pick your man, Kirby. You too, Cage. Good work. When cows give beer, on top of that, Sergeant's got to be out of it. You shut your mouth, Kirby. I've about had it with you. Now, we're moving out like I said, and that's all you have to know. This war doesn't depend on any one man. Not you, not me, not Saunders, not even the company commander. All I meant was that... It's what I meant that counts. Wow. Hear that man? I never saw him that jumpy before. How would you like to be in his shoes? Well, if I was, we'd be heading for the rear right now, I can tell you that. Don't kid yourself, Kirby. You would be hitting your head on these walls just like he's doing because you wouldn't have a choice. You still don't have to jump all over us like that. Who's blaming him? Maybe he is. Your girl? No. She goes on with anything in pants and takes them. You know the type. You know something else? I give six months' pay to be with her right now, being taken. <laughs> you ain't worried about those blood relations of yours up on the hill, are you, Clint Smith? What do you think? Well, it wouldn't hurt a countryman like you. That's what I figured. Except how are they gonna know? Hey, what if I goose-stepped all the way up, huh? <laughs> Sound funny? <laughs> Very. <laughs> hey, Mike got a kick out of this. We gotta go up the hill again with that machine gun. We? Yeah, you too, Klein Smith. Both of you better stand by.
stuff we're in. It's not so bad. You've been out before. It's worse now. I'm scared to death. Don't think about it. Remember what I told you? You don't think they're gonna hit you. They won't. Huh? You don't think they're gonna hit you, they won't. One this time. 21, huh? That's how it comes out. How much you owe me now? $18,972.41. Well, I'll get rich if I live. All right. Cage, you and your men are going to go up on your bellies. Zero in on those bunkers, especially the one on the right. We need hits. Line them up and squeeze them off. A gun port isn't much of a target, Lieutenant. It's all the target you get. Staggered fire, but aim fire, understand? Yes, sir. You ready, Kirby? Yes, sir. Use the draw to cubby on the way up. As soon as the rifles open fire, dig that gun in. I want it in action. Yes, sir. Hey, Kirby. You think we're going to make it? I don't know. Just shut up and follow us. You all set? Yes, sir. What do you want, Doc? Well, sir, I was thinking if those mortars couldn't do the job, uh, they'd pack a lot more power than a few rifles. When I want to hear from you, I'll ask you. Can't be taken. I don't know, Saunders. Going to back inside. Get off your feet. There's nothing you can do here. You sure, Lieutenant? I'm sure. It's all mine. And I'll take care of it. I never doubted it.
Let's go. I can hit us on Next time, Lieutenant. Like 